Hello, and welcome back to Hardcore Minecraft Season 2, Episode... I believe this is 37. I honestly didn't check, so if I'm right, that's going to be shocking. But, with this episode, I'm going back to the Nether. One of the areas I hate the most. But, there's something we desperately need in the Nether. I said I wanted Nether right before I could fight the Ender Dragon. Well... I'm going mining for netherite. I'm terrified. This is the first time I've ever done this. I've always gotten to diamond armor and then never tried to get the armor higher than that. And it doesn't help that the nether update is a little bit on the newer side. So I actually had to look up where to find netherite. Because I've never tried to find it. None of the people I play with know where it's at. So we're, we're here. And I, I'm terrified. Also, in between videos, we have a new farmer. His area isn't exactly set up yet. He's just here. I needed somebody to trade carrots to. So, he's here. Took me forever to get him. But he's there. Oh, I don't have my gold on me. That would have ended very bad. Let's go back and do that real quick. Okay. Now, the best place to find netherite is 15, level 15. So I think I'm just going to go out, get as low as I can here normally, as close to my portal as I can get, and then get down pretty far. Now, let, let, let's go okay. down. Everything I've read says that 15 is probably the best to go to if you're mining for netherite. So, don't panic guys, that, that was a hole I made, it's fine. I'm going to do the bed method, which is kind of on the dangerous side. And I'm, I'm freaking terrified. I'm going to take off the gold while I'm doing this because I'm terrified it's going to kill me. Ooh! And that's the reason I put the diamond armor back on. Oh, this is gonna be fun. I'm probably gonna get myself killed doing this. Oh, I am definitely somebody who likes explosions but should not be playing with them. That gets less and less scary, which does not bode well. Oh god, I'm standing on it. You know, you have fire resistance, Tigers. Why aren't you using it? Oh! I actually didn't expect to find any this time. thought I was going to have to go back and get some more beds and stuff. Okay. I don't know. I'm pretty sure fortune doesn't work on these guys. I don't know if that was just incredibly lucky or what, but I just got three right there. Hey! Well, apparently this is actually working. I was having doubts for a second there, I'm gonna be completely honest. But it's working, it's just taking time. Okay. I ain't got too many left. Oh, and there's another one! <laughs> what is with you? Okay, apparently this tunnel has some luck to it. Okay. Here's two more. Now, I don't have any more beds. I do have some prepped up back home, but I'm definitely going to have to actually come back out here again because... I found six pieces. I didn't expect to find six in this episode, I'll be completely honest. I expected to maybe find one. And that's if I got really, really lucky. Now the question is, what do I put my one piece of netherite on? Because I think you need four pieces of netherite for, for netherite scrap. For one netherite. So, what do I put it on? Probably one of my pickaxes, let's be honest. 
Do I put it on my fortune or my silk touch? Both of them kind of need to be netherite. My axe probably also needs to join that. Because they're all pretty good. I know they're not the best that they could be. But they are pretty good. Now, if I'm correct, I need a smithing table. Which I do have one, technically. And actually, I was wrong. Or was I right? Four, five, six. Yeah, I was right. Okay. <laughs> my boots definitely could be better. So I don't want to put that on there. Maybe my chest plate could do with something. Honestly, my fortune pick is probably the best item I have. And my shovel. Neither one of those am I going to look towards replacing any time in the future. So I may just go ahead and turn my uh, fortune pick into netherite. I'm actually going to need my silk touch here. Actually, it doesn't even matter anymore. Forgot I changed this out for cobblestone. Now, my smithing table is up here. Fortune? First piece of netherite gear I've ever had. I just need a moment of silence for myself to squeal internally. I'm such a nerd, but I... It's fine. I'm fine. Okay. Now here comes the thing of I need to collect more... Do I still... Okay, the potion finally wore off. I'm probably going to go quickly grab some more wool, make some more beds, and then head back down there. Well, that's just a wall of lava. <laughs> Opened a door and it's just like, hey, lava. Oh, I almost walked straight into you. That's a bunch of lava. Okay. That time we weren't as lucky. I didn't get any on this go around. But we can always come back. Okay. Now all of my armor took a major hit from that. So I'm quickly going to go do some trading. And get the durability back on most of my stuff. Back up to 100. Except for my pants. Okay. And to finish up a bit more of this episode, I'm going to continue some more work on the dock area. I still have to convert a lot of this to being slabs, as well as getting the design of the lamp post and the little stuff in between. I still have to get a lot of that up. Granted, I don't have a lot of material to work with. I do have some trees planted over there, so I could probably just grab those and just keep working. Okay, and there we go. All the way down. And it's all marked out. Now I just have to convert all of this to slabs. Now there is going to be a bridge here in between these two. There is going to be a bit of a bridge here. Because my next biggest build, kind of level with the library up there, is going to be over here. So I do need a bridge over to it. So that's where that's going to be. And then I want like a smaller dock over here. Maybe closer to like this little grotto area over here coming out from here a little dock just so they can go down the river and stuff because fishermen and stuff would probably be using the river so I think for the time bling, bling being I'm just going to blend this into the wall here and then figure out where to go with it from there because this can always be modified now, give me a few minutes. I'm going to try to get some more of this converted. Okay, and there we go. Now, this doesn't look like much, but I actually got this entire section next to the cows. And this entire section in front of them. So, this is actually a huge chunk. Granted, it took over, I want to say, 10? 64 stacks of slabs. And that's not counting the extra like just plank blocks I shoved in here so that I could stop the water so I could dig out more at one time so there is a lot of stuff that just went down and here. with that 
with our first ever netherite found with us working on the dock a little bit i'm going to have to say goodbye for now i hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys later Bye bye